What is up my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King John City Four and today I'm here to bring you guys a little bit more of Battlefield 1 gameplay. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and by the way this is from the 64 man celebrity match. If you guys did not see it I suggest to search it up man. There's a lot of hilarious moments especially the one with Snoop Dogg and Wiz Khalifa because these two guys they look like they were fucking smoking weed in there man. I don't know how to tell you guys this but uh they look like they were smoking weed but it was not weed you know to be honest it was just a blunt you know those flavor cigarettes that taste like freaking um like what's it called it like cherry and some other bullshit like it, it's just cigarettes guys don't, don't know very exaggerate with 420 and weed and shit like go crazy with dog doge or whatever the fuck the the meme is so um anyways yeah you know this is from the 64 man celebrity match and uh you know i finally got a clip out of this and uh you know from this weapon from what i can tell it is super darn accurate. <laughs> the way this guy handled this weapon is just incredible. And I was thinking like, oh, you know, it's just a pre-alpha footage. Because, you know, the pre-alpha, we still don't have any balancing going on with the weapons. We still don't have any, you know, nerfing going on. So, of course, every single gun has to be accurate right now. Because, you know, you also have celebrities playing in the game. And, you know, you want to make them kind of look good. Because, you know, you know, they sometimes don't play video games all the time. Because they got some other stuff to take care of. So... I'm pretty sure every single weapon was accurate in this game, but as you can see, you know, you guys, you guys can kind of see a little bit of a, you know, detail going on to this weapon, especially on the rain side. And uh, also, I've been hearing a lot of things that, uh, you know, the weapon once it like it, get, it reaches some rains on it, the the rain will like drip off from the gun. That's amazing effects, man. I cannot wait to see that in myself. So um, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be only on PC though. Because I know the PS4 and the Xbox One ain't that strong, you know, and I'm a PS4 player. So, I kind of admit that I really want a PC. I really want a fucking PC, man. It's, but it just costs a lot. I cannot. I have to sell my car for that shit. <laughs> so, uh, anyways. Actually, if I do sell my car, I'll get like $3,000 or $4,000. Because, you know, it's a, it's a recent year car. So, anyways. Um... Battlefield 1, what do you guys see from here? You know, what are you guys getting some knowledge from? Because I know some of you Battlefield freaks out there are pretty much getting knowledge from this. And, um, you know, what I can say is to keep your distance, man. You don't go short range for this. And also, another amazing thing that was happening in this whole gameplay, this guy was getting hit fire kills with this gun, with a semi-automatic. I was amazed by it. I was like, what the fuck, man? Y'all gotta tone down that shit, man. So, I'm pretty sure they're gonna tone it down, man. They gotta nerf the shit out of this gun. And, um, another thing is, the paramedic, uh, this guy is now holding syringes. No, it's not like Battlefield 4 over there throwing freaking health care, uh, healthcare packages. And, uh, also, they, they, they don't have the defibrillators like they do in Battlefield 4. This time, it's just a syringe for everything, you know. Syringe to heal yourself. Syringe to heal somebody else. Syringe to revive anybody. So... It's pretty much the range 24-7. It's not healthcare pack or defibrillators. You know what I hated from Battlefield 4? People using the defibrillators in front of the enemy. Why the hell would they revive me right in front of the enemy? That was the most annoying thing ever. God damn Battlefield 4 players. So anyways, uh, so what do you guys think about this gameplay? Is it cool? Is it awesome? I'm pretty sure those are the only two options you can describe this game because, you know, Battlefield 1 is going to take it, man. I have a feeling this game is going to be the number one FPS game of the year. I'm pretty sure of it. So that's it guys, I wanted to talk about, I'll be leaving you guys with two more extra minutes of the Battlefield 1 gameplay and hopefully you guys enjoy it. So, if you guys want to see more Battlefield 1 gameplay, make sure you subscribe for more. We are losing objective Edward. Ha <laughs> 